Okay, this is something new we're doing, but I'm super excited about this. Now, tonight's signature cocktail is the flavorful Johnny Walker Red Label. That's Johnny Walker Red Label. We all had to make up a recipe using Johnny Walker Red Label and share them with you all and hopefully you'll be inspired. So, Selena, what's the name of your signature cocktail and what ingredients did you add to your drink? Oh, well, honey, I, Miss Claudia, I took it all the way back to the clubs of early 2000s, honey. I went and made a whiskey sour with the Johnny Walker red label, honey. I used 1.5 ounces of the Johnny Walker. I used three fourth ounces of lemon juice, three fourth ounces of a little piece of simple syrup, threw a little orange on here and a little piece, and three little, little cherries for the, you know, the look of it. And when I tell you it is, mm, tasty, it is. It took me all the way back. So when I was first out in the club, honey, this was the cheap <laughs> drink, but it was still so I, mean, uh, I, that that I remember back in the day, days, you thought you was yes. grown. You was like, yeah, I'll have a whiskey sour. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. mm -hmm. I thought love you it. Good. You know, I don't really know. I don't have a lot of recipes for drinks. So I am so happy about this new segment because I get to borrow from y'all's, you know, y'all recipe books. Lisa, yeah. right, you already know I love your your cooking. So I, I'm looking forward to hearing your drink. But first, Vivica, what cocktail did you bring to happy hour? Well, darling, you know, as bad as the weather has been all over the place, <laughs> I needed to go and feel like I was in Jamaica, <laughs> hanging out of food, okay. celebrating my birthday again with all of y'all. So okay. I'll have. My drink is called Fire and Spice. It has 1.5 Johnny Walker Red Label, some ginger ale, and a twist of lemon. It is so refreshing. I'm serious. It takes me back to Jamaica. Like I said, just kicking back, lounging, and toasting it up. No that problem, Juan. That was such a fun trip. We had a good old time in Jamaica, didn't we, ladies? Oh, my yes. God. Yes. Best time ever. I still have our pictures. When I miss Jamaica, I, I look at them. We was cute and tanned. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, this year I turned 50, so I'm going to try to do something big. I hope the queens can all come to my birthday. I don't know what's going to be, but uh, I got a, I'm I got going. big shoes. I'm to going fill in. somewhere tanning, too. You know it. <laughs> okay. Got, now, Lisa Ray, you are a, a master in the in, in the kitchen, so I know you created a nice cocktail for tonight's show. Please tell us about your drink, because you usually got the tea. I don't be thinking tea is in your cup, but I want to know what's in your drink tonight. Oh, look at you. Look at you. Look at you. <laughs> But let me grab my drink so you can uh, get the, the the visual of it. Because I had to invite Johnny on over to my house over here to the set where I met in Atlanta. <laughs> okay. So this right here, I call it Johnny Walker Red Lemon Passion. Let me tell you what's in here now. Oh. Five ounces of the Johnny Walker Red Label. I did six shots of lemonade. I took two strawberries and cut it up and I muddled it at the bottom of the glass. Mm -hmm. And okay. I did one shot of Sprite for the fizz. You know what I mean? Of it. And I stir it around like this, mm -hmm. like that. You know what I mean? Add a little ice. Let me get a little mm -hmm. ice. Drop, 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 drop. Bam. Like that. Uh-uh. <laughs> <laughs> in the house. Let me make my day toss it up. Okay? So you I'm know what that, that looks like? Tell me, Fred. Lisa Ray, is that the, uh, the, when you did the thing with the cherries, it turned it a pretty red. It's pretty, huh? My strawberry. It's pretty. Yeah, oh all these good old recipes. Okay, well, what about um, yours, Miss Claudia? Well, name of my my signature cocktail is simply Johnny. Now mm -hmm. I added Johnny Walker Red oh. Label, one point five ounces, some Simply Lemonade because it's my favorite drink. I love Simply Lemonade and a square of vanilla extract to cut down on. You know, kind of give it a little something like exotic, oh, wow. something exotic. Give me a little tropical feel to it. Let me see if it tastes good though. I don't know yet. Hold on, let me see. I, I, I never would have thought about vanilla asterisk. Yeah, that's really interesting to do the vanilla. I, you know, what, bef before you drink it, you smell it, and it, mm, it smells, it's like it's like it, it hits your nose first. You're like, mm, I'm about to tear this up. So okay. yeah, it's gonna be this. gone by the end of the show, huh? <laughs> Man, who you telling? It's gonna okay. be one of those shows. Okay, listen, everybody. I am so happy the queens got to share their own. Signature cocktail that they made up their very their, on their own, and of course we want to encourage everyone to please drink responsibly at home. Be safe about this. It's fine to have a cocktail, but be safe and drink responsibly. All right, ladies, let's toast oh to a great show. Hey, Here's salute, queens. Salute. This vanilla smells good. It's vanilla in. Mmm. Mm. I got to be careful not yes, to bubble mine all the way down because it's so yummy. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, ladies, 
it's okay for us to have a drink because today we are celebrating the life and legacy of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. I want to go around the panel.